talk to this guy to get the real World War One pistol. plays it off as an accident even though it's a little bit cheesy to do it like that but who cares really to be honest Place that mine there for later. Now this part is really tedious because you have to wait until he comes back. I mean, if you aren't familiar with this actual level at all and you're doing it straight away, the uh, reason I went to the receptionist, he gives you a World War One pistol. And the guys on stage are actually using a prop World War One pistol. So when, you know, eventually he come into this room, he'll put his gun down. You replace it with the real one. He gets killed. Happy days. Well, for us, not for him. Poor him. Yeah, but sadly, you just have to stick through this. You can't old tab or anything like that. It's annoying. I mean, it's pissing me off. See, this is the point we're trying to get to. The chap on the right actually has a pistol we're going to be using. Oh, I can't really remember. I think they do one more iteration of the last part of the song and then they'll come back. That's still long enough, honestly.
Right now, thankfully, we don't have to wait for this part again. Because the problem is, if you miss this, you have to keep on going over and over and over and over again. Oh yes, fantastic. Bloody brilliant, he says. Absolutely spiffing. I want to see another go of that. I'm not sure if you can use the map in professional. Um, yes, you can. So now you can see Chappie coming here. Now his buddy will be right in front of him, actually. You don't need to worry about him. Matey boy will sort him. Or at least you should sort him out. You would definitely want to make sure you don't do what I do and actually put down the prop gun again and take the real World War One pistol with you. And so, you know, kind of wasted like five minutes doing that. Oh, shut up, you stupid frog. Oh, wow, look at him. Real sharpshooter. Excellent. This is the part you've been waiting for. He will now leave the room. This is your time to strike. Now you can, I think you can leave this point, at this point, honestly, um, but I can't remember, honestly. So I'm just going to wait here, wait till he comes back, gets his gun, then I'm buggering off. And this is where calamity starts. On dirait un vrai. Heureusement que ce ne l'est pas. Fantastic, no one suspects you of a single thing. Sorry, champ. Conveniently, that door is blocking. Oh god, I'd be crying if that wasn't. Now you have to listen to it one last time and then it's all over for them. You don't have to listen to it again, everybody's panicking. Fair enough, whatever he said. Hmm. 
And unfortunately, you can't really speed this part up, so you know, you're just admiring your handiwork. A little bit of luck's involved in this because there is a worker who actually sits up there doing some work. And ideally, you don't want the bomb to explode because that doesn't count as an accident. And if it doesn't count as an accident, that is no sign assassin. You know, they really went to town on uh, the voice acting on this, you know. History culture of France. Oh, you can hear that situational music now. Oh no! Oh no! He fell down! Oh yes, he's dead. Oh no, some tomfoolery and trickery has occurred. <gasps> But wait, my lover! I mean, I think it was. I can't remember the bloody story. Fuck. Now you ask, you know, why did you put the bomb up there? That's why. Oops, a fucking daisy. Yeah, something is wrong with your fucking shit. So the most important parts, you know, two accidents, not caught on camera, no witnesses, a silent assassin. It took 14 minutes, but most of that's waiting. And some nice money in the bonk. So yeah, good stuff, man. Congrats, you completed it.